But more or less, though, pay attention to what's going on around the world, bro. We are literally entering some demonic times. Like, we are not too far from the Christians being killed for their beliefs. Look how the apps be shutting us out and taking our videos down for nothing. Meanwhile, you got videos of people getting killed on here. You got videos of people half-naked on here. They don't bother them at all. You got California that just accepted an after-school Satan club for the children. You got Disney that had the kid toting up, we love you Satan signs. You got a new movie on Fox called Little Demon where the girl gets possessed and her dad is the devil and she finds out that she's the Antichrist. You got the baby who was playing Jesus Christ on the cross. You got Kendrick Lamar who was wearing thorns around his head, blaspheming God. You got the Balenciaga situation that was promoting child porn with this sign right here that says Baal. And in the Bible, Baal is a false god that they used to worship and sacrifice kids to. And around the Baphomet symbol, it says, do what thou wilt. If you look up what Balenciaga means when it's broken down, it means do what you want. You got the people of Israel saying that they found their Messiah, which we all know is the Antichrist. You got the Euphrates River drawing up and in the Bible, it says that there was fallen angels chained up at the bottom of it waiting to be released. And then last but not least, you had Satanists gathered together, unbaptizing people, right? And then you had other Satanists in another country where the Bible says that Satan's throne is. They were worshiping the grounds, begging Satan to come back on earth. And I don't know how I forgot about this. You got this demonic movie on Netflix where they hold up this symbol and they make you repeat all the words after them. And you don't know what they're saying while this is demonic sound playing in the background. And they do this multiple times throughout the movie out of nowhere for no reason at all. So I'm going to keep it 100 with y'all. We is in the last days in real life, bro. If you're a Christian, you got to be prepared for whatever comes because you don't know what's about to start happening. Because you can see people hate us for no reason already. God bless y'all. Get right with God. And if you ain't right with him and don't know Jesus Christ, get to know him. You hear me? Open up the Bible and start praying.